First at five for years, she said she was battling a good old boy system. Today, Precinct 2 Constable Michelle Barrientes Vela learned her successor will be another woman. In an appointment that could take effect as soon as October 11th, county commissioners tapped veteran law enforcement officer Leticia Vasquez. Dylan Collier with a look at her background and her tough road ahead to restore the public's faith in that agency. <laughs> Let's make this sort of clear how unusual this is. After five quick moving interviews this morning, county commissioners settled on Deputy Leticia Vasquez as the appointee to take over their troubled Northwest Side Constable's office. Her 25 years with BCSO, including her most recent assignment in community policing, drew rave reviews from the people tasked with finding a successor. The people that do know me will, will know that, they're, that I do have integrity, that I do, that I am trustworthy and that I can make a difference. Yes, I will be seeking the chair and the seat of the sheriff's office within Bear County. Current constable yes. Michelle Barrientes Vela's public declaration that she would run for sheriff next year triggered the state's resign to run law. She declined comment today on Vasquez being named as her replacement. While a court will decide how much longer Barrientes Vela stays in office, her administration could be on the way out as well. Twice in the past six weeks, the defenders uncovered records showing the constable was paid back for law enforcement training that she, her chief deputy, and captain never took part in. It's not just the constable under investigation, so you know, uh, Leticia going into this seat is, is going to have some house cleaning to do. Barrientes Vela will not go away without a fight. Her attempt to block this appointment will go before a judge one week from Friday. Inside Bear County Commissioner's Court, Dylan Collier, KSAT 12 News.